The year is 2020. Robots have completely eradicated the human workforce. The only means of survival that remain are earning rations through robot servitude or coding new algorithms. The future is bleak, and the Terminators are coming. All right. So that's probably not going to happen in the next few years, but that doesn't mean we're all not still secretly fearing that it might. After all, if robots took our jobs, how are we going to survive? A study from Pew Research suggests that 72% of Americans are fearful of a future where robots and AI machines can do human jobs. This includes driverless cars, machine learning technology, essentially anything that a robot may soon do that humans used to. All this worry leads to good sales of anxiety medication but how much of it is actually founded in truth. Several recent academic studies have placed the percentage of US-based jobs at risk at 35 to 45 percent, a number that would completely wreck the US economy. But what about the rest of the world? A study from YouGov found that 60 percent of Europeans think that robots will soon lead to fewer jobs, and 27 percent predict that the job loss will be significant. Experts also predict about the same level of job risk in Europe as in America due to automation. So while the numbers may vary, the human race as a whole is pretty worried that automation will ruin our chances of finding work or possibly even surviving. But what do the experts think? They can't seem to agree. Elon Musk, one of the most famous warners of the future AI takeover, claimed that if we don't closely monitor automation, it could spell doom for the human race. While Elon may be one of the biggest names spreading fear, most artificial intelligence experts think he is doing just that. Oren Etzioni, CEO of the Allen Institute for Artificial Intelligence, think that Elon Musk's obsession with AI as an existential threat for humanity is a distraction from the real concern about AI's impact on jobs and weapon systems. In other words, Elon is probably selling fear. Toby Walsh, author of It's Alive! Artificial Intelligence from the Logic Piano to Killer Robots, say that Elon Musk's remarks are alarmist. But who's telling the truth? Is Elon Musk humanity's savior and bringer of truth, or are the experts right and AI and automation should be a minor concern to the future of jobs? If you're concerned about your job and want to know how much of a risk you're at for being unemployed down the line, there's a website tool just for that. WillRobotsTakeMyJob.com allows you to simply type in your job title and within a few seconds you can see how much of a risk your job is at for automation given current trends. Chances are, the people that will be the the most impacted by the robot revolution are those that just can't adjust. In other words, workers who can't change what they do. Think about it. If you only know how to input data into a certain customer database, or you can only answer phone calls from certain customers, then you're the most at risk for automation. The workers who will be the least impacted by AI growth will be those who can adapt and overcome to the demands of the new robot future. This has already rung true in how the global workforce already functions. In the worldwide industrial revolution in the mid-1800s, we saw a growth of factory jobs and otherwise menial work on a production line. Machines took jobs from the trades and allowed anyone with simple training to make things. But now look at the world today. Sure, there are still workers on production lines, but robots are doing most of the grunt work. Humans are only needed for the seemingly simple but complex tasks like finishing work or product inspection. The humans that kept their job in this modern shift to automation were those that learned new skills and worked to use robots supplementally. The best thing that we can do for the uncertain future is to become versatile and valuable. Learn new skills and ultimately learn to adapt. If you can make yourself valuable when 70% of your job gets automated, chances are you'll stay gainfully employed. 